Similar triangles, grade B, level 8 question. Okay, part of this question is, is realising is to do with similar triangles. We've got a parallelogram, we've got this side is 12, this bottom side will also be 12 because they are parallel and uh, in a parallelogram opposite sides are the same. And this would be 2 and this would be 8 if we needed those. Now, we can clearly see this triangle here, this big triangle and this small triangle. Let's just separate those out. They are similar triangles because they share the same angles. This side and this side are parallel. It tells you EF is parallel to uh, AB, so they are parallel and therefore the angles are the same. So, in similar triangles we can work out a length of the side if we have corresponding sides. So this whole length here is 2 plus 8 which is 10 and this one is 2. So what's our scale factor to get from this triangle to this triangle. We're going from 10 to 2. Let's just divide by 5. We could divide by 10 and times by 2, but it's the same as dividing by 5. Now on the base here we're going from 12 and we want to work out this length because we're trying to find XF. And we know this whole length is the same as the top one which is 12, so if we can find EX and take it away from 12 we get the answer. So to find this base length we need to do 12 divided by 5. Now 5 goes into 12 twice with 2 left over, so 2 fifths, which is 0 0.4, so 2.4. You can use a calculator here, and uh, I would re recommend using your calculator just to check your answers if you're not too great with fractions and decimals. But that length is 2.4, so this XF, XF is going to be equal to 12 minus 2.4, which is going to be 9.6. Now, there's five marks for this question for what is not that difficult a question. One of those marks is a, a special mark for showing clear working. Um, I must show your working. There's a little star next to the question which tells us you get an extra mark for the, setting out your work properly. So if you clearly showing what's going on here, there's a scale factor one fifth or divide by five, and then you work out this out, set it out neatly, you get an extra mark from the four marks available for the answer. Um, you're going to get, if you get to this point, 12 divided by 5, that's worth uh, 2 point, uh, that or that, 2.4, it's going to be worth 2 marks, and then you get a method mark for doing the takeaway and 1 for the answer. And that's pretty much it. Originally when I did this, looked at this question, I actually went a bit over the top and thought about this triangle here and spinning that round and making this the similar triangle and just going from the big triangle to this triangle. Um, using the scale factor of divide by 10 and times by 8, which gives you the same answer, um, but this one is, is a clearer method of similar triangles.